I want to thank the Ounce of Prevention for always raising the bar, always raising our conscience, and always making sure that we consistently raise our commitment to making sure that every child in the city of Chicago gets a world-class education starting at the most important years. We are at an exciting moment in the Ounce's 33-year history. And we are standing today on the precipice of dramatically increasing both our reach and our impact. We believe in the power of the parent-child relationship as the cornerstone for all learning. I have high expectations for parents because I want them to have high expectations for their children. And guess what? The relationships we forge with parents work. I have seen it, and it is a powerful and beautiful thing. I know I can achieve what I want because my mom has built a comfort zone around me. She's helped me through good times, tough times, and has known what to do to make me successful. She hasn't quit and won't quit until I'm successful. Our future is tied up in our children, and we want to make sure that all of those children have the tools to be able to contribute longer term. Education is simply a good investment. For moms all ages, especially young moms and their partners, I'm there to offer support, encouragement, positive reinforcement, and be someone they can call at any time of the day or night when they're scared or have questions that they're afraid to ask someone else. This is not just about the children in this community. It's about all children, all families, all communities. Creating a tipping point where we become a true early learning nation. So we have to have bold plans. Our country's future depends on it. So many of you who are here today know us well. You know that the ounce has been driving change in this field for over 30 years. And I'd like to thank all of you who have come to today to support the ounce and its work. Our bold plans are only as good as our capacity to execute them. Together, we can inspire minds and change lives. Thank you and good day.